Hey guys, my name is Dave and welcome to another video. Story about LBS today. So, in the past I've vented about the program OBS. Well, normally when I do that it crashes for absolutely no reason. And in the past I've tried to see if uh, updating the program would actually work and it actually made the situation worse. In the past, every time I've had to fix a problem with that, yeah, I ended up having to delete the entire and uninstall the entire program and reinstall it over and over again. Now, the reason I bring this up is actually I've had an I had another issue with it, uh, the software recently, right before recording the video that you guys see later today. Well, not directly before. I needed a large break because of what happened because of how dumb it was. But I digress. Um, <clears throat> so when it the problem did occur, I tried every aspect that was going on, and it stayed the same. So I was like, okay, fine, I'll try updating it again. I haven't done that in a while. It probably needs like three or four updates. Maybe that's why. And for some stupid reason, this time it worked. Last few times I tried. OBS's updates have fixed something, but broken something simultaneously. And then you'd update it again, it would fix that something, but break another something. This time I updated it, and it's working just fine, so... This is not really a venting video, it's more me confused. If you're going to build a program, you really shouldn't... I mean... I, I, I feel like some of the updates on it aren't really tested at all. At least not thoroughly. If you're going to do like a software or a hardware, thoroughly test it before releasing it. Otherwise, you may get some frustrated people. I'm not frustrated about it now. I was, I will admit, up until I found out what was going on, I was pissed. It was making me extremely angry that I always had I, I, I can't even give a number to how many times I've gone through stuff like that but at this point like what was pissing me off was the fact that I did the things that I normally do and it was still broken so at this point if you're gonna I'll, I'll, the word of advice to those who use OBS if you're using OBS you're basically working with a small thread that can detach at any point in time. You always have to be ready to catch the other piece. Even if your other hand is busy, you always have to be like mentally prepped with like watching. You're like doing other things with your other hand. You're watching it. It breaks. You have to be suddenly ready to put it back and then just get back to it. It's, I don't know. It's kind of dumb. It's like walking on a tightrope and prepping for anything. When you walk, in, when you, normally when you walk on a tightrope, you're focused on the walking. But in this case, it's like you're walking on a tightrope in the middle of a battlefield. That best probably describes OBS. And it's kind of sad that I have to describe it like that. Mm, I don't know. That program has always had issues, and it's always going to, I feel like, so it is what it is. Anyways, I guess that did kind of turn into a vent. Thanks for tuning in the video, guys, though. Uh, if you agree with anything that was said on here, make sure to give the video a like. Uh, we do vlogs on a daily basis, along with one gaming video that comes a couple hours later. Uh, check that out while you're at it, if you'd like. Um, but in the meantime, I'm going to head off. Thanks again for tuning in to the video, guys, and we'll see you guys later. Bye.